Hi, Arielle. Today, we're going to be reading Snowflakes in the Summer, written by Anne Hearth. I don't know about you, but where I live, there are never any snowflakes in the summer. It's always really warm. So here goes, Snowflakes in the Summer. Grandpa sat on the couch. His face was red, sweat dripped down his cheek. Want to go for a walk? Kayla asked. Grandpa wiped his face. No, it's too hot. Wow, see how sweaty Grandpa's face is? Kayla was hot too, but she loved summer. Grandpa hated it. He never wanted to do anything. Do you like summer? Is it one of your favorite seasons? We could visit Mrs. Peters, Kayla said. She always has cookies and lemonade. No, Grandpa said, it's too hot to go anywhere. Kayla opened the hall closet. Let's play a game. She took down a pile of games. No, Grandpa said, it's too hot to move. He closed his eyes. Are any of these games games that you like to play? Kayla sighed. She wanted to do something. If Grandpa felt cooler, maybe he would play with her. But how could she help? Grandpa snored. What do you think she's gonna do? Kayla looked around the room. The sun shone through the window. The chairs were red and the table was orange. The rug was dark brown. It is hot in here, Kayla thought. It even looks hot. I know, Kayla said. She ran to the desk. She took paper and scissors from the top drawer. She folded the paper into a triangle. She folded it again and again. Grandpa still snored. What do you think she's making with the paper? Kayla cut the corners from her triangle. She cut squares and circles from the edges. She unfolded the triangle. It was white and lacy. A snowflake, she said. Kayla made six snowflakes. She taped them to the window. They blocked the sun. She looked around again. We need more snow, she said. Kayla found some white sheets. She draped them over the furniture. She spread them over the rug. She stepped back. What do you think the room looks like now? Snowflakes covered the windows. The furniture looked like snowy mountains. The living room was white. Grandpa still snored. Kayla went to the kitchen. She filled a glass with ice water. Grandpa, Kayla said. Hmm, what? Grandpa wondered as he sat up. He looked around. What happened, he asked. It snowed, Kayla said. Here, she handed him his water. Grandpa took a sip. He smiled at Kayla and pretended to shiver. It's cold in here, he said. Want to play a game? So our first question is, when does the story take place? What season do you think this story takes place in? bet we can find the answer right at the beginning. How many snowflakes does Kayla make? Why does Kayla decorate the apartment? Let's see if we can find the page where she talks about why. Here's what the apartment looked like before she did all of her decorating. 
And our last question is, how does grandpa feel about Kayla's project? And that's it. Thanks so much for reading with me today. Bye.